Hi, Michelle Seitz here. You're watching the lesson on captions. Here's the scenario. You have a document with numbered headings as well as some tables and figures. You would like the tables and figures captions to include the heading numbers in the captions. Watch this video to learn how to do this. Here we have a document with some numbered headings, some tables, and some figures. In order for the heading numbers to be inserted into our captions, the numbering schema in our document must be correctly formatted. So on the Home tab, in our multi-level list, I want to show you how I formatted these numbers. So I'll click the down arrow and the highlighted list style is the one I created. I can right click on it and select modify so I can show you how I did this. First I gave it a name. You can give it some characteristics here, but you also must go into format numbering. And make sure you click the button called more. Our level one heading is linked to level heading one. This is very important. Level two is linked to heading two. Level three linked to heading three and so on down the line. Now that we know our headings are correctly numbered, place your cursor where you want the first label. This is our first table. Go into the references tab and in the captions group, select insert caption. Our first label is a table. It automatically incremented the number. This is the first table in this section. In order to add the heading number to the label, you have to click on numbering. The format field can place the number of the table, or if you prefer, you can label it with a letter or Roman numerals. I want mine to be a number. Now in order to include the heading number, you have to click this box. These two fields become active. Since I want my label to be linked to my heading one, I'll click heading one. In this field, you can separate it with a hyphen, a period, a colon, or a dash. I want mine separated with a hyphen. Click OK. And as you can see, it added a hyphen and the number one. So in section one, this is the first table. I'll click OK. I like to format my captions with a colon and I like to add a tab. That's just my preference. Let's do one for figure. Place your cursor where you want the label. Go into insert caption and change this label to figure. Now the numbering, check that the box is checked for chapter number and heading one is entered and hyphen and select OK. And OK again. Let's go down to section two. This is section 1.1, which is heading level two. In order for heading level two to be inserted in my label, we need to change the chapter number in the captions dialog box. So place your cursor where you want your first label. Go back into insert caption, select table, 
and in the numbering, instead of heading one, we want it associated with heading two. We're gonna say okay. And as you can see, the heading level is 1.1, and this is the first table in that heading level. And we're gonna say okay. Let's do the same thing for this figure. Place our cursor where we want the label. Click insert caption. Change this to figure. Check our numbering. It still says heading one. So we wanna make it a heading two and say okay. It entered our heading level. Before I click okay, I wanna show you what this new label is. If I click on new label, I can create my own label. So if I had some appendices with tables and figures and I wanted them numbered, I could create a label called appendix. So now in the label dropdown, appendix was added. Since we don't need this label, I'm going to delete it. And I wanna put my figure label back in and say okay. And that is the end of this lesson, Captions.